Hayden and Kevin's late night stroll lasts until the wee hours of the morning in chapter 2083. Walking through the streets with her, Kevin talks about how his family, Serenity and Callum in particular, influenced him to go after her personally. Hayden finds herself caught in the complex web of familial interference, a stark contrast to her once peaceful life. His confession sheds light on the orchestrated nature of their relationship, leaving her feeling manipulated and disturbed. She contemplates the repercussions of this revelation, considering ways to extricate herself from the persistent pursuit of Kevin, whose determination to marry her seems unwavering. As the night's conversation concludes, she remains silent, contemplating her next moves in this dance of emotions. The chapter hints at Hayden's internal struggle, grappling with the consequences of Kevin's pursuit and the interference of his family. The story takes a surprising turn when Kevin declares his undying love for Hayden, promising to never give up till he falls in love with someone else. Hayden, deep in thought, strides forward without responding, leaving us to anticipate the unfolding relationship between the two characters. The chapter reflects Hayden's resolve to find a solution to the predicament she finds herself in. Her silence becomes a metaphor for the contemplation of her next steps, emphasizing her agency in navigating the difficulties of her relationship with Kevin. As the night wanes, the two of them continue their walk until 2 a.m., with Hayden strategizing on how to save herself from the persistent pursuit. His declaration that he may not be in love with her adds an additional layer of complexity to their interactions, leaving us intrigued about the future developments in their relationship. The narrative transitions to the following day, a Saturday with no work obligations. Hayden hopes for a peaceful morning, but her plans are disrupted by an early phone call. Hugh, her younger brother, interrupts her attempt to sleep in sharing the news of their mother's request for her to return home for lunch. Hayden, groggy from lack of sleep, scolds her brother for calling early. The mention of York's brown candy, a funny title given to Kevin due to his relentless pursuit, serves as a reminder of the challenges Hayden faces. The chapter concludes with you revealing that Kevin Understanding Hayden's need for rest, impose a restriction on the timing of the call to avoid waking her too early. This information gives Kevin's character more depth and reveals how much he cares about Hayden's well-being. <laughs>